Hello and welcome back. Today we've got another £250 worth of 50p's. Uh, we're looking for the commemorative coins, the ones with more than face value. But ideally, no dirty coins today, please, if that could be a thing. The amount of scrubbing I had to do with my hands to get that gross coin slime off was just grim. But um, we, have got, we are missing still Kew Gardens. We are missing still Olympic wrestling. We found five Olympics in the last video. That was unbelievable. Best Olympic haul I've had in ages. There we go, all the modern ones, all the way up to and including Paddington at the Cathedral. So let's cross our fingers. Maybe today we'll find something awesome. So what are we looking for? I'll show you in the first bag. We'll do the first bag in real time. So, oh, did you see that? Did you see that? Well, this is S.H.I.E.L.D. <laughs> we'll look for the years 2009, 10, 11, 16, and 18, which are not intended for circulation. But also the year 2017 is a low minted year. Let's see if I can bypass that next coin. That's uh, Britannia. We'll look for the year 2008, which is a low minted year. Um, I looked uh, I looked through them at the end of the video and update you before the end. Um, so you don't have to sit and watch me do that all, but I will try and spot them as we go. But this is our first find, an Olympic volleyball which is a very nice coin to find. Even nicer in better condition. I have a horrible feeling this might just be more of the same of those grim coins we were finding. But to find an Olympic this early on is pretty spectacular. I'm not going to grumble at that. So yeah, anything Olympic, especially ones that we need. We've got Jeremy Fisher there, the first, first from the 2017 Beatrix Potter set, which are very, very common. Oh dear, look, this is going to be more of the same sort of gross coins, isn't it? What on earth is going on with these? What was that? Another Olympic shooting. Holy Toledo. I am like, the, the last couple of 50p hunts that I've done are absolutely mind-blowing. I've not had this kind of luck for ages. Maybe it's a sign. It's coming towards the end of the year. There we go, Benjamin Bunny. That's a more common one. Let's stick him on the counter. We've got counters for Benjamin Bunnies, Peter Rabbits from 2017s, and also dictionaries. Oh, and also the 2019 Peter, uh, Peter, uh, Paddington, Podrington Bears, <laughs> and Sherlock Holmes. That's Victoria Cross the Medals. A very common one to find. That's going to be something in 2017. It's Tom Kitten. Holy Toledo. We're just missing Peter Rabbit to finish that set off. We've got something else there. It's going to be a territory, 1997 jersey. Wow, what a first bag. Two Olympics and a territory. Holy Toledo. Hopefully that is a sign of things to come. But what we'll do now is just speed up until we find anything. Oh, there you go, Benjamin Bunny. Get him on the counter. Got the UK's entry into the EEC there. That's a nice one to find. It's slightly more than face value. We're still finding those grim coins. We are still finding some grim coins. Let's hope that this is someone's collection. Maybe they had a Kew Gardens. Paddington Bear at the palace. Very cute. Seventeen shield. That's a keeper. What's that? What is it? Oh, it's the Capture Gibraltar. I didn't even recognise it. I thought I found a brand new 50 I've never found, and it's a disgusting quality one. Unbelievable. What is going on today?
And there we go, there's our first 2017 Peter Rabbit, if you can make it out. Makes up our 2017 set. Oh, Taylor Gloucester. Very cool design, one of my favourites. We've got a people act there. Very common. There's an iron side. Common design, but lovely one. We've got Girl Guiding there, another common one. And Victoria Across the Meadows. Benjamin Bunny, get him on the counter. And another one. We've got a lovely go guiding there. And a Benjamin Bunny. There's Paddington at St Paul's, the cathedral. We've got Benjamin Bunny for the counter there. We've got a Battle of Britain. So on the 50p's Battle of Britain, you can find two initials under the Queen's neck on the obverse. IRB, which is Ian Rank Broadley, the designer of the Queen's portrait. Um, and that one was put into the collector set. So someone's broken that out and paid it into circulation. You've got a chance of finding that. The one with JC was Jodie Clark was issued for circulation. I've never found an IRB Battle of Britain yet. And this coin isn't going to change that. That is a JC you can see just there. But the hunt for the IRB Battle of Britain continues. There's another Benjamin Bunny for the counter. And we got another dictionary for the counter. First dictionary of the hunt. Roger Bannister there. That's a common one to find. There's a Tom Kitten. Oh gosh, I promise you that's a Victoria across the meadows.
We've got a dictionary. Oh, I see a Benjamin Bunny. Get him on the counter as well. Victoria Cross, the heroic act there. It's another common one. And that's 2017, that'd be something. Peter Rabbit. Paddington at the Palace as well. So that's what three in a row. Can we make it four? Mm. No. Peter Rabbit for the counter. <laughs> and another gross dictionary. We got a Guernsey. That'll be something. Freezes from 2008. Lovely. Always nice finding territory coins. There's another dictionary. We got Team GB there, that's a common one to find. Oh my goodness, another gross dictionary. And a Paddington at the station, my favourite Paddington. Got the UK's entry into the EEC. I tell you, whoever this, this has got to be from someone's collection. These dirty coins, there are so many of them, it's ridiculous. Ooh, we got another Olympic. Olympic equestrian, holy Toledo, three Olympics. Wow, well, the person with dirty coins had quite a few Olympics as well, so I'm very, very grateful for that. Another UK's entry into the EEC. So dirty, you couldn't tell which, can't even tell what way around it goes, that way. Uh, Commonwealth Games there, very nice. Well, we're on to the last bag. I am quite taken aback at how gross these coins have been. I am not particularly impressed with... Hang on. That's a 2011. Oh dear. 
if this is my wrestling it counts if this is my wrestling it counts if this is my wrestling it counts oh it's weightlifting i'm a bit glad <laughs> as upsetting as it is to see an olympic in that kind of quality olympic number four unbelievable well if all my hunts could be this lucky i don't mind i wouldn't mind having to dig through all these dirty coins but if you've made it far into the video, you feel free to join my Discord server if you're over the age of 13, and that's the Discord rules, it's not my rules. Uh, you can also contact me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and the PA box. We've got a dictionary there, which you can put on the counter, and on the pile of dictionary. We've had lots of dictionaries today, haven't we? It's been an odd couple of hunts the last two 50ps, but I shan't complain. Four Olympics, unbelievable, right? Well, I'm going to have a look through the coins off to the side to see what key dates we've got. Well, that was quite successful, to be fair. We got one, two, three, four, 2008 Britannias, and two, 2017 Shields. So, very successful. And again, four. Four, holy Toledo. One less than last time. Four Olympics. Unbelievable. Nine Olympics in two videos. What is going on? Even if we had to get through probably about £100 worth of filthy coins. The dirtiest coins I've ever had to hunt through. But there we go. And all that leads me to do now is thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you've had some good luck as well. And I'll see you next time for more coins. Bye.